Hey guys, April Marie here from AprilMarieTucker.com coming at you with another Instagram tip and I'm really excited to share this one with you today. I actually shot a video, uh, I believe it was Friday or Thursday, and um, shared a few things about this Iconosquare.com that you know will allow you to you know promote and get more um, Instagram followers and things like that. And today I just wanted to, to kind of also finish it up with another way that you can use Iconosquare because um, you know, if you use Iconosquare, you can actually simplify a lot of the marketing that you're already doing. So if you're doing any type of social media marketing, which you should be doing, um, for example, like Pinterest, Google+, Facebook, um, that's one of the great reasons why I like Instagram is I can use it to also market on Facebook at the same time while I'm marketing on Instagram. So, you know, giving value through your social media and, you know, using Iconosquare and, and Instagram to kind of simplify that for for you is going to allow you to have a lot more fun this summer, I believe. So really quick, um, we're actually at Iconosquare right now and it's Iconosquare.com and I'll leave the link for that below this video so you can just go ahead and sign up. If you haven't already, you can sign up. Another really cool thing is if you don't have an Instagram account, you can you know follow other Instagram accounts and things like that and network with people still using Iconosquare. So you don't necessarily have to have the app or a smartphone or anything like that to do that. So you can sign up for Iconosquare. Um, and then once you do that, you will you know link your Instagram account. If you don't have one already, you can sign up, like I said, and you'll be able to get all your images here and stuff like that. Okay, and so what I do is on like, you know, at least a couple times here and I will just, you know, check out some of these cool images that I made and with, you know, InstaQuote is one of the apps that I actually recommended in a video also not too long ago, but InstaQuote's a really good one. That's how I created this this image right here and it's just a quote. Um, but it's great content to be sharing over at, on Instagram. People really like it. It's already got 48 likes. I shared this about three hours ago. That's a pretty good difference considering that um, with like Facebook, if I were to share this on Facebook, I might, I might get 10. You know what I mean? Because the algorithms and stuff like that over there. Um, so what I like to do with this, these images is um, once you share it on Instagram, it will show up on Iconosquare and you can come on over here and you see these little social media buttons right here. You can use it to share. Simply, like I love to share on Pinterest because Pinterest is an image site and like I'm a, you know, I'm also a member of some other people's boards, um, like group collaborating and stuff like that. And it, you know, there's a lot of people like, for example, I'm going to show you right here, quotes. Um, and I, and this isn't a Pinterest training, but it's just one of the places that you can share and you just use Iconosquare to, to spread some of your beautiful images that you're creating on Instagram across all your social media and stay active there as well. So you already have this beautiful image. You created it with, you know, InstaQuote, shared it on Instagram, and now you can use Iconosquare to come over here and also share it on Pinterest. And you can do that. I mean, you can do that across all of your social networks, Google Plus, you can share it on Google Plus and I would just say you know if you don't know where you want to be in 90 days you know you'll never you'll never get there I mean you could actually just say what you already said over here or, or however you want and just put it up there on your Google Plus and now you're spreading your content around and actually repurposing it so you know just being interactive on social networks that maybe like for myself I'm not always active on Google Plus that's not like where I mostly hang out you know but now that I have Iconosquare I'm able to stay a little bit more active over there because I've got cool content to share all I'm doing is re-syndicating it um, content that I already have out there on Instagram and on Iconosquare and re-syndicating it over to Google Plus and that makes my job a lot easier because now I'm not having to think up new content to share on Google Plus on Twitter and all this stuff no, I can just share the same content but spread it across all my social media networks so that I'm saving a lot more time in my business. So really, that's a really great tip if you want to save time and really stay active on those social networks. One thing that I have always really prided myself in doing and, and has made me very successful on the internet is staying in front of my audience. So whether it's my Twitter audience, my Google+, Plus, my Facebook fan page, my Pinterest, my Instagram, all of my social media networks, I stay very active there. And I love it when I can take little shortcuts like this so that that way I'm not spending a lot of time, too much time doing things that, you know, you know, 
um, take up a lot of time and take me from other activities like following up with my prospects and, and you know, generating leads and things like that. Even though I need to be doing these things, it just it saves a lot of time. So um, with that, guys, I hope you enjoyed this tip. I hope it really helps you. Once again, that's at conosquare.com. This is April Marie from aprilmarietucker.com. And if you enjoyed this video, be sure to share it. Be sure to comment and like it below. And I will see you on the next video. Thanks for stopping by. Bye for now.